Yo man, Mr. Popo back at it again with another super 10% off, super power, look at the super magic, whoa! What's up guys, it's your super players back at it again with another video and this time we got ourselves another market watch and not only that, it's just the new cards that came out, the expansion set, Retail price they go for $16.99 and I've been seeing the prices of this cards just jump and skyrocket like crazy. I think it might be because of the ARG event coming up or it's just the fact that these black and these hero cards are just so broken. Let's double check the prices and let me show you what they are. So retail price they're supposed to go for $16.99. Let's see what it is. So the expansion set for the hero mighty hero box is $29.94 guys. $29.94 that is insane that is almost double the price of what it was initially supposed to be sold for if you go to Target that's how much you'll find it for $16.99 they won't be selling it for $29.94 so we have a bunch of um, card websites that are selling it for $29.94 $95 $98 so almost 30 bucks so a lot of places are selling it for $30 and uh, let's check out um, oh this is the evil one I thought I got it on eBay I guess I don't I messed up but nonetheless, it's $29.99, so it's $30. Bucks. Let's go on to the villain expansion set. So the vi villain expansion set, let's see, the Dark Demons villains. $39.89, whoa, that's insane. That is insane, $39.89, that is, whoa. I did not expect that, I'm gonna be honest. This thing was supposed to, well, in Ohio, it was going for about $18, bucks. $18.99. Uh, shout out to Super Collectibles, obviously, for the lowest price right there. And, yeah, they're going for $39.89. Jeez, that's expensive. So a lot of these places are selling it for $40. Bucks, so you're looking at the Mighty Heroes being $30. And then because the black cards are so amazing, it is going for $40. Bucks. That's why I think the Villains expansion is an insane amount right now. It could be hype. It could be because of the ARG event. We'll see in about a few days how the weekend goes with this event. Maybe a few days later. I'll keep you guys updated, but let's keep moving um, forward. The next card we're going to be talking about is Time Patrol Trunks. Foil version, it's $16.30. That is almost as much as the Villains Expansion Pack. Retail price, like I said, is $69.99. This card's going for $16.30. Whoa. This card is amazing guys. I don't know if you guys know what it does, but you should check it out. See the ga gameplay you could do and the crazy combos that people are doing. People are saying they love the Kale combo. I love this combo with the double strike. That's how I finish people when they're trying to negate everything and I'm just going to go all out, especially with this guy. So this guy is $16.30. Let's see who has the cheapest prices. So somebody's selling it for $15.32, but it's a dollar shipping. And um, Core TCG, our locals here. Um, Pro Play Game 1634, another one for 1547, 99 cents shipping. So you're looking at about 17 bucks for this card, 16, 17. Um, because the regionals are coming up, good luck for good luck to everybody that's going to Indie ARG. Good luck. Um, you're gonna need this card. If you don't have it, pick it up ASAP. It's gonna save your butt. It's such a clutch card. And let's check out eBay. eBay sells it for someone selling one for $19.95. Someone selling a playset for two pre-owned, $16. So if you want to buy, these are non-foil. So if you want to buy the non-foil one for two, it's $16. But if you like foil and having a bedazzled deck, <laughs> it's going to be a lot pricier. Someone selling it for $9.72 for one. For plus shipping, you're looking at about 30, 12 bucks. About 12 bucks. Um... We, whoa, someone's selling a full playset of the hollow or the foil for $64.99. Uh, who else? Offer them the best offer. Good luck to you guys if you guys do. Hopefully you guys get it. Someone else is selling a full, two foil ones for $27. $23. $19.93. Uh, $23. Uh, $24.99. So you're looking at about $20 for a non-foil or foil trunks. That is insane. I didn't know this card was going to be that expensive, especially because the villain's expansion set was going for $16.99. And this card itself makes up that price. So if you get yourself your hands on one of them in Target or Walmart or wherever they sell them, um, 
you're pretty much making your money's worth, but it might be because of hype or because of the ARG events coming up, or it's just a really good card, guys. It's a really broken card. You get to see the top two cards and pick one, put one on top or in the bottom of your deck, which is amazing. And then we'll just move forward to the next card. It's gonna be the Mass Saiyan, the Mysterious Warrior Foil. It's forty four forty nine dollars. Four dollars and ninety cents. It's a great card. You play you overrealm and then you um warp up to five uh that adds a uh, total of cost of adds up to five or less and send them to the warp area. So you get to play this card, you use one energy, you warp all your opponent's cards. And up to five. And he's double strike, so if you Made your opponent drop all their cards, and you know they can't go for, like they can't defend anymore. Use this guy, use one energy, and go for a game. That's what happened to me two times, and <laughs> it was unexpected. These cards are very unexpected. The black cards are like surprise, you're dead <laughs> if you can't defend. And he's four dollars and ninety cents, three ninety two shipping is a dollar. Um, so you're looking at about four or five bucks for one. This is the foil version. Um, so a lot of people are selling it for. Four or five bucks, so that an average of five bucks. And let's go on to eBay. eBay is six thirty nine for a foil. Non foil goes for three twenty five. Um, non foil goes for five bucks. And here we go. Some people are selling non foil and foil for seven ninety nine. So if you want to pick one up or pick up two, side deck them. I say do it. Uh, here we go. We have a non foil five ninety nine. Someone selling a foil version for eight ninety nine. So TCG player is a little bit cheaper than it is on eBay. So yeah. Nine bucks, ten bucks, five bucks, or offer your best offer plus shipping. Good luck to you guys. And someone's selling one for twenty dollars. That's insane. That is crazy. So you can see how, like, how much potential these black cards have. They're gonna become staples in a lot of decks. I feel that they will be, especially the ones that drop to your hand, or you're you're gonna want to use them to use the warp um, effect. The overwhelm effect, sorry, and just go for a game. It's a surprise card. These black cards are so amazing. You should check them out, pick them up. It's awesome. And let's go on to the next card. I think Comrades Combined Vegeta Foil is a great card. Um, he's 396. He's from the Hero Expansion Pack. I think this one's a very great card just because he's a two drop if you run mono blue. But he's still a 3 drop, but he's 20k, so this brings out a lot of pressure to your opponent, and he's a 5,000 combo piece if you want to use that. And he's searchable with the Goku, you can see the price trend spike with this card specifically. Um, he went from 296, and I'm pretty sure the prices were still going up. Um, pick it up, it's a great card for those Vegeta decks. Someone's selling it for 396, 398, so you're looking at about $4. And on eBay, let's see how much they're selling it for. Selling it for $2.99, $5.99, $3.25. So you're still looking at about three to four bucks for one. That's still pretty expensive. And here there's a playset for um, or pre-sale for the non-foil Goku, which searches out any Vegeta ca uh, card that's I believe three or less. I'm, I'm not mistaken. I'm not sure. Let me double check what the effect is. Just to be on the safe side for you guys. It is look up to energy cost three or less. Yep, I was right. Um, he searches out any of those critical cards or those um, or this one right here for those Vegeta deck Vegito decks or any deck in particular you're trying to go for game maybe this guy could do it. If you run mono blue, it's a two drop, 20k, which is amazing. And I started seeing the hype of this card. Jiren. Jiren is $23.99. This guy was about $13 a few weeks ago or about a week and a half, two weeks. And $23.99. And he's still averaging about $29, 25 in TCG player. And that's insane in my opinion. Maybe it's because of the ARG event that's happening. I'm not sure. But there is some hype for this card. He was $16. He was an inexpensive card. For one, yeah, 16 bucks is expensive, but now he's doubled. That's insane. He's almost 30 bucks. Or he is at 30 bucks. And let's go on to eBay. Let's see how much they sell on eBay. 27. If you want to place a bid, 11.50 for one. Good luck to you guys and anybody else that's bidding nine, twenty-two dollars. These are bids. These so averaging this card's above twenty bucks as of now. People that are bidding, someone's selling it for thirty. So you're looking at between twenty to thirty dollars. So if you're lucky enough, pick one up for twenty. Maybe if you want a ball like that. If not, then you can hold off on it and substitute it with something else. But Jaren is a great card. I love the card. He gets rid of any card, problematic cards like blockers or um, 
tokens, whatever it is. And moving on to the next uh, card that we haven't seen that we, last time we saw it was pretty like it was 20 bucks. It went up. It's 28.99, obviously because ARG, and it's just getting a lot more play, obviously. And it's 28.99. You're looking at 30 bucks, 34. Averaging, whoa, someone's selling one for $59 for near mint. That is crazy. So, <laughs> average is 30, 30, 35 for one kale. That kale is becoming a very sta a good staple for those blue green, those blue soul striker Goku's, the starter deck. Um, she's just a great green card in general to get rid of any problematic cards like tokens or any of those one drops, two drops. And it's a critical 20k. And if you have I believe a limited amount of cards in your hand she lets you draw a card and let's look at eBay eBay selling it for if you're bidding good luck to you guys it's 12 bucks right now someone's bidding 24.85 buy it now is 28 dollars if you're trying to bid it's 10 bucks right now so you're averaging about like 30 bucks it's gonna play like stop there um yeah 30 bucks plus shipping 39.99 25 26 so you're looking at between yeah like about 20 20 uh, 25 to 35 bucks for one kale who knew this card was gonna be that crazy expensive and all that and um that's pretty much it that's all the cards we were looking at that have been getting a lot of hype and just skyrocketed within like the week two weeks we've, i've seen it and like we always say from the super players, y'all stay super.